Hello and welcome back to Let's Talk by George. Well, in today's tech news, what we are trying to do is we are trying to get you new information about Magisk update. So there had been a Magisk update and the last known version of Magisk was 23.00. So yesterday we have received an update and it is the 24.0 for the Magisk and that is a version. Okay. So if you are using 23.0 as your Magisk and what you can do is you can either go to the Magisk GitHub page. I will post the um, link in the description below and get the application file install the application file on top of the uh, on top of 23.00 and install the update so you can manually install it from the um, from the magisk itself you don't need to boot into recovery and uh, update your magisk all you need to do is go to github page download download the apk file install it in on it in your phone and install the magisk from uh, 23.0 upgraded to 24.0 well what are the changes there there isn't much user interface change so what really happens is you get sigisk beta so what you need to do is you need to enable it if you want to pass the uh, play store certification earlier we had magisk hide by default but this time you can enable uh, magisk beta so if you want to um, enforce the deny list definitely you can do that and if you have some banking application being installed on your phone you can configure the deny list from the from the deny list itself and if you want to see system application you can click on system application and uh, search for uh, search for whatever system application you want to enable the magisk hide or the deny list to in this scenario let us look for play services and uh, yeah so let us hide the play services so basically if the uh, the the play store didn't pass by enabling sigisk uh, beta you click on to uh, you enable the enforced deny list configure deny list and from that if system apps didn't didn't show up you need to take uh, you need to click on the three dots over here show system apps and it will show the system apps and you can uh, you can configure the deny list well that uh, these are the major changes in the magisk 23.0 and as you can see bottom here earlier it was kind of floating uh, menu for the user uh, super user logs and modules so basically you don't get any online modules as we used to get in the 23.0 i have not seen any modules online so basically if you want to install your favorite module and stuff like that make sure that you have the modules in your um, in your sd card so that is about the magisk latest update and please make sure to stay tuned to let's talk by george